Well, welcome to the semi-finals here on the 20th at uh, Wimbledon Stadium, the Daily Mirror Sporting Life Grand Derby. And there you can see, we've just seen one. There is two Glengar Ranger, three Luxury Light, four Gentle Warning. Move along slightly to Handsome Henry with Barry Silkman. And then last but not least, a dog trained by Nora McKellistrom. Apparently this dog is exceptionally nervous. Well, there's a nice long distance picture of the uh, first set of semi-finalists walking their way around. They have about another 50 or 60 yards, about another three minutes. And once again, I'm joined in the studio here by Mr. Pause for Thought himself, Errol Blythe. Errol, thank you very much for joining us again. Good evening, Richard. Good evening. Now. The first semi-final looks a foregone conclusion. Glengar Ranger, nothing quick on his inside by the looks of things, and uh, Luxury Light, not too many fast sections, got a 507 and a 5 dead on his inside, so possibly he could test him. Harold, how do you see the first semi-final possibly unravelling? Well, hopefully we're going to get a good clean race, but that said, <laughs> very unlikely. Glengar Ranger obviously goes up middle towards the first bend. Luxury Light could be could trap faster than Glengar Ranger, wouldn't surprise me, but Luxury Light might come to the end of his tether at the third bend. If Glengar Ranger gets passed early on, then it should really go to Glengar Ranger, the odds on shot here. But uh, strong finishes, you've got to look for Windsor Abbey, seems to have a peach of a draw in one. Gentle Warning might not get a clear run in four, or Big Ball, that's the one to come along. It seems to be coming to himself now, or Big Ball, after a brief uh, respite with injury, and I think Nora's done a terrific job to uh, just get him so far in the competition. Well, I was speaking to Mary Pleasure, head girl, earlier this afternoon when they were kenneling, and um, she said the only problem, Richard, is he's a terribly, terribly nervous dog, and possibly if he does qualify for the um, semi uh, for the final, it could have a problem. Here's the latest betting: Windsor Abbey opened at six, is now seven. Glengar Ranger opened at six to four, and is now eleven to eight. On Luxury Light, opened at seven to one, is still seven to one. Gentle Warning's gone for a walk in the market, opened at five to two, is now seven to two. Handsome Henry was twenty to one, is still twenty to one. And all big ball they've had a nibble on is seven to one to eleven to two. Well, there's um. That was Errol's view, and as you know, Errol uh, runs the programme, Pours for Thought, and uh, he deals in grounds all day long, and um, he hasn't been too far out uh, on previous occasions when he's visited us at the studio here. So, um, according to Errol, and I'm going to go along with Errol, I don't think there's going to be too many problems for Glengar Ranger, with possibly all big ball and either Windsor Abbey or Luxury Light possibly following home. But then, of course, it's the semi-finals, as you say, Errol. Bob Rowe earlier said to me that He's seen some terrible results in semi-finals at White City, so um, ask you for the winner, Errol. A ask you for the winner, excluding... Well, no, no, go on. Uh, first three, Errol. Glengar Ranger, or Big Ball, Windsor Abbey. There you go. So the gentle warning fans who are watching this tape will be inundated, <laughs> will be inundating calls with SIS. But uh, there's, uh, I think, two or three more to go. Uh, Luxury Light isn't in yet. You can just see he's now in. Handsome Henry's been installed, and it's only a matter of putting the nervous dog in. All big ball. They're in and ready. This is the first semi final. The first three go through to the final, which will be shown on Sky Live on the 27th. Hair's on its way. Glengar Ranger in two, six to four on. Pup go to traps and around and a pretty level break, but it's luxury like onto the front, luxury like Glengar Ranger as they go into the first bend. Oh! Luxury light is on the floor, which leaves Glengar Ranger well clear of Windsor Abbey with gentle warning in fourth and all big ball beginning to try and make up a bit of ground into third place to qualify but the first two places look assured with Glengar Ranger being challenged by Windsor Abbey, Glengar Ranger, Windsor Abbey, Glengar Ranger, Windsor Abbey, Windsor Abbey has won it for me with Glengar Ranger second and gentle warning bringing up into third place. Errol, great semi-final, we'll watch the replay bit of a collision at the first bend. How did you see the first semi-final? It was a terrific race, wasn't it, Richard? Uh, Glenn Garranger didn't pop out of the boxes as fast as I thought he would, but he's managed to get to the front at the first bend, pushed out Luxury Light. Unfortunately, that took a terrible knock there and was uh, knocked over. But uh, a terrific race in the end between Glenn Garranger and Windsor Abbey. You've got to remember, though, when it comes down to the final, Windsor Abbey might not get such a clear run come final night. If he, He's managed to get a, a perfect solo round on the inside, is placed uh, Glengar Ranger all the way. I'm not quite sure who's actually got up, Richard. 
Well, I'm going to go on a limb, Errol. I mean, to say we were discussing earlier about Windsor Abbey, how she finished well, slow away, ran on, slow away, ran on. She done it this evening. I think, in actual fact, um, I'm calling her she. It's a dog, Windsor Abbey. I think he's actually got up on the line to maybe head Glengar Ranger by the shortest of short heads. But as you say, Errol, a terrific semi-final. Glengar Ranger, Windsor Abbey. With gentle warning coming into third place. So they're the qualifiers Windsor Abbey, Glengar Ranger, and gentle warning. Winning time 28 68. Errol, um, 28 68. Um, you wasn't saying too much while the race was on. I believe the only anti post bet you've had is Windsor Abbey. Yes, 40 to 1 Windsor Abbey. I'm smiling all the way to the bank, hopefully, but I'll have to lay some of that off on the night. Well, there you are. Sure, Judge for SIS. Thanks very much, Errol. And Errol will be remaining with us for the second semi final.